and gentlemen, welcome back to Tech Showdown. My name is Kevin, this is my co-host Teddy, and in this video I'm going to be announcing the winner of the uh, Asus giveaway that I did about, mm, we started the giveaway, what, about a month ago? Something like that. And that was to win uh, this uh, Asus ROG hat, uh, the ROG shirt, and I decided to throw in there a NVIDIA hat, just because... I thought you guys might like it. Um, so yeah, quite a few of you uh, responded. All I said was just to put a comment uh, on that video, and it was about 119 comments. So I just went to uh, random.org and then did, you know, from, I can't remember, I think it was I did from oldest to newest. And uh, and then we just did random number generator, so it was all uh, very fair. So the winner is Old School FPS. So, uh... Yeah, so that was the uh, first one that came up. So I'll be sending you a message. So make sure you check your uh, YouTube inbox and there'll be a message in there from me and then we'll sort it out uh, how to get all this good stuff to you. Now, if a week goes by from when this video goes up and uh, old school FPS hasn't decided to uh, respond to my messages, uh, then there'll be a runner-up. And the runner-up is Tell Me Shades. Interesting name. Uh, so yeah, uh, and after a week, if Ultico FPS doesn't respond to me, then you'll be the runner-up and I'll be messaging you. And uh, then you can grab all this cool stuff. Because hey, you may as well, right? So that's this fun little giveaway I decided to do for you guys. Uh, I hope you enjoy it and we will be doing uh, another one quite soon for uh, my 10,000 subscriber mark. Now, I wanted to do a sort of another fun thing with this video and do a sort of uh, a five fun facts about me. So, as you know, we've done quite a few Q&As, but this one I just thought I would just tell you some things about myself. And the first one is one that I think you'd all be quite curious to know, and that is, what GPUs have I personally owned? So this is disregarding any GPUs that I might have bought in, in, in order to just do a review on that GPU. I wasn't buying it with the intention of actually keeping it uh, for myself. So these are ones I bought specifically to own. Now, my first GPU that I ever owned, and I didn't start sort of getting into PCs until, I don't know how old I would have been. It was in my high school years anyway. But the first one uh, that I can remember in my own personal rig was the NVIDIA 7600 GT. And I can't remember which model it was or anything like that. But that was the first GPU. Uh, I ever had in my own personal rig, so uh, that was quite cool. I remember that being a big thing. The one I had didn't have any fans on it, it was just a huge heat sink on it. So that was quite interesting. Then there was quite a big gap because I didn't really change my rig for quite a long time after that. And um, my next uh, graphics card I had when I decided to do a new rebuild was a NVIDIA GTX 570. So, I obviously never touched the 400 series from NVIDIA, but I went to the 570. Now, I was originally going to go for a 560 Ti, um, and I did actually have one in the rig, but it had problems, and uh, I had to exchange it, so I just thought I might as well go for the 570 at that point. And that was the reference model one, so uh, it got a little bit toasty. Then, uh, when the 600 series came out, I decided to upgrade. And I just did the direct upgrade from the 570, which was the 670. But this time I decided to go for a non-reference cooler. And I went for the Windforce cooler, as I had been reading reviews. And a lot of people said it was very good. And the Windforce coolers were doing very well. So that was uh, my first Gigabyte graphics card. And that 670 was the end of the NVIDIA line of graphics cards for me. Now, um, it's not because I have a bias anyway, uh, I, you know, towards either company, but it just so happens that that uh, seemed to be the end of it for NVIDIA, for now, anyways. Um, and then my next card after that was the Reference R9 290. So I got that, put that in the rig, and that went really well. As you guys know from, uh, if you subscribed to me when, when Tech Showdown first started. And, uh, and then I switched out the Reference 290 for what I... Uh, as I said when I was doing my 290 series, what would be the best 290 after I'd concluded the series, which was the Sapphire Vapor X 290, and then that went in. So that was uh, quite a good graphics card, and uh, I liked that. And then, of course, now we've gone to the 390X uh, Triax, as you can see in my rig right now. So that's been my run. So pretty fair, I'd say. I've done three, I've owned three uh, NVIDIA graphics cards and three AMD graphics cards. 
So, uh, Perfect Bell, it's kind of the reverse to Linus, actually, because he went A and D for a while, and then he's gone all NVIDIA, and I went NVIDIA uh, in the past, and then now I've gone all AMD, but, um, yeah, I hold no bias either way, and I'm really keen for what NVIDIA brings out next year, and that might make me go uh, back to NVIDIA, depending on how well it does. Now, to the next fact, um, is, uh, do I own a, a console? So, I actually do, um, but it was only quite recently that I got it. Uh, so it's a uh, PS4, and the main reason I really wanted a PlayStation 4, and I actually got it as a birthday present from my girlfriend Catherine, which was very, very nice of her, uh, is because there was a few exclusive titles that I really wanted to play on the PlayStation 4. Uh, the main two was the uh, Uncharted series, and the other one was The, L the Last of Us, so uh, yeah. But um, I have quite enjoyed it, it is quite good. Uh, some of those games are quite good, but of course I do obviously prefer PC gaming. Uh, a hell of a lot more than console gaming. Now, my favorite streamer, so this has been my favorite streamer for oh, a long time now, probably about, you know, coming off four or five years maybe, uh, he's been my favorite streamer, and that is uh, Root Cats, so Cats from uh, Root Gaming. Now, he used to stream a hell of a lot of StarCraft, more recently he's just been doing a lot of Hearthstone, uh, but I find him really entertaining, his streams are really good, he has really good taste in music, and that's just kind of like my go-to stream. Uh, when I just, you know, want to just watch someone and uh, I really do enjoy his stream. Now, what is my current car? So my current car is a uh, Toyota Wyndham, or it's kind of like a really good uh, Camry. It's the um, Toyota version of the, the same model car by Lexus. Um, so yeah, that's my car I have right now. It's quite good. It just gets me around really nicely. It's the V6 model. Um, before that, I had a uh, Toyota Levin BZR, and that was a very good car. I really like uh, the engine the Levins have, the 4H, and I've had, uh, I also had an old school MR2, which also had a similar engine in it, but the supercharged version. So, yeah, um, I'm quite a Toyota fan. I really like Toyota cars. Most people, because, you know, I, am, I, I have a bachelor's in automotive engineering, most people from the industry you'll find uh, do quite like Toyotas. Um, just reliability and build quality and all that fun stuff. And now what I use for editing. So currently I'm using a Sony Vegas, although I am thinking of changing soon because it is getting a little bit annoying to uh, probably Adobe Premiere. So uh, I've had a few people you know, mention it to me in the past and that's probably what I will go to because I don't really see anything else right now uh, that would be a good upgrade from Sony Vegas. But um, yeah, if you know of anything, leave it down in the comment section below. But I am looking to change my uh, editing software as I'm always wanting to make tech show down better, have better equipment, um, and also, you know, edit things better and just make the whole show uh, as good as I possibly can. Now, thank you all for watching this video. Please subscribe to Tech Showdown if you haven't already and like the video. And as always, I'll see you guys next time.